Hi everyone. So I can't believe that it's our last week with the videos. Um, it's been interesting uh, doing these videos. It's not something that we often get to do like in a physical setting. Um, but for this week we were told to talk about George Marsden and his ideas, mythology, and all that. Uh, with him, I feel like since we've been reading him for so long, like we all definitely know his ideas for sure. Um, he was somebody who was an advocate for wanting Christian scholarship to be out there that it should not be kept in the dark and throughout all the years of uh, colleges and, and history generally, it's been put on the back burner. And I feel like he really describes that very well, using other uh, schools as examples, uh, using other historians and their examples. So I feel like... His mythology of using that is very uh, well. And also him being very organized in each chapter. Uh, even, even though, honestly, I feel that he was repetitive in a lot of what he was saying. He just, I feel like he wanted to just make his point come across. And I think he did very well. And what was kind of like sad was the very end of what he was saying that uh even though he wrote so many things that he's not known or a lot of historians won't be known because of just what's out there now with technology and things like that and how Kristen Christian scholarship is still on the back burner and that is just going to be hard now to kind of have his ideas be put out there. Even though they are out there, a lot of people just don't know about him and probably a lot of people will never know about him, which is kind of like a sad note to end on with him, but he's a very realistic person person um and I I feel like he gave me a big insight on really putting in Christian scholarship that it's not bad it's not awful it's just a new perspective on history and different sides to it and I think that's what he's really trying to uh, hone in on and make sure everyone understands so with that I feel like he is uh, a very detailed author, really trying to advocate for what he believed in. And I think that with that being said, with us reading it, we have a job to do to try to spread the word and just try our best. And we might not succeed, but at least if we can get to one person that's something so um I feel like Marsden was probably very interesting and more of a realist about it also but trying to really give people that like new thought way of thinking which he definitely did with me so that's basically all I have to say and Thank you everyone for watching all the videos and my discussions.